There's here that's looking at something or someone. the ball will always result in a fatal injury that leads to death if you, well, kill the guy. And what do we have to do here? Oh yeah, it's that puzzle, isn't it? This one's Interesting. So, what are you? Can I look inside you, please? You're a straight one. In other words, I'll put you right here. You, sir, are... Another straight one. Well... Spoilers, we need to connect the pipes with the boxes. However that works. You are another straight one. However, you are positioned in the wrong way, so to speak. Well, not that it matters a whole lot, but there you go. That means the last one must logically be the corner piece. Let's just flip you around like so. And so, and I inadvertently put it exactly right. No, Raziel, you idiot. That's not the way you should have done that. I need to push it that way. Now the pipes are connected. You see, the thing is, that um, pipe will flood that pool once we turn on the water. Unless the pipes are connected. Ah, for the water wheel. I was wondering why we'd be doing something silly like that. So it was for the water wheel. Legion doing puzzles without knowing why since a long time ago. <laughs> I'm actually really not quite sure why I'm bothering with all the magic. Wow! You can't do that. Ah. Yeah, yeah, you're big and scary and I'm stuck in a little room with you. Goody! No, let me through. Uh, you know what? Taking the easy way out. Or not? Really? This room does not have an exit in the Spectral Realm. Nice! Nice! So, shoot as yes! Shoot, 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 shoot! Shoot to kill! He's waiting right on the other side. This is not pleasant. And I can't stun him sufficiently. Gah. No, 
Raziel. Will you? Stop it already. Freaking thing. So, let's just assume he died. And get out of here. Um, I sure hope there aren't any enemies on these stairs anymore. But I'm pretty sure I left uh, that one up, up, up there alive, didn't I? Yeah. You. Well, you must die, but. That works. That works perfectly for me. Now, with turning the machines on, the lighthouse should, by all means, now be spinning and emitting light. And that's exactly what we needed to do. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. I know what to do. You don't need to show me all of that. And the beam of light hits the triangle things for a short time. Come on, game. Now we need to get into this room. The first time I did this puzzle, I think, I did it on accident. Wow. Or it glitched out on me. One or the other. Huh. Whenever the light falls in, that big vagina looking thing opens. Well, then let's extend the amount of time it shines on the thing. And kill everyone in the vicinity who suffers from that seizure disease. What's it called again? Dang it, I can't believe I forgot the name. Anyway, the light glyph, or whatever you want to call it. Kind of amazing. It kills just about everything. Well, that's it. Oh, we are having sound issues. Massive sound issues. Oh, right, I'm not at full. You know what? In that case. I'm quickly gonna go and, well, restart the game. Why hello there and welcome back to... Well, but I'm not entirely sure why I said that because as far as I know this might still be in the middle of an episode. Um, <laughs> I restarted the game and restarted the recording so I could meet you here. And do we have anything to do near the... Yes, actually, we do. Sure, I was gonna go to Raziel's lair next, but... The pillars seem a much better place. To, well, start. Since, well, they are the next object on our list. Pretty much. So we have two spells. Dang. That costs a whopping 10 magic. Ouch. Oh, you silly, silly bugger. As if you could actually contend with me. 
<laughs> now over there's Rassiel's lair. However, I wanna go this way. Because there are things to do in this general direction. Yeah. Wow. We could have come here quite a while ago, actually. I think all we really needed was the ability to go through gates in the spectral realm. And that should be it. Now this place is massive and confusing. It has more secrets than it needs for its own good. It's the citadel of you of the humans. Um, where does this lead? I'm gonna need to have a good look. Am I glad you are worshipping me? Because that was a flamethrower. Um, I see, I see. So what you're telling me is we should push one block here. And put the other one on top. On top. So that we can make it up here. Ooh, that's a nice duck. Right, and from the human citadel, its towering walls and deep moats engineered to keep Nosgoth's vampire plague at bay. Well, it seems to have worked uh, to some degree. I really do need to get down there again, though, because I'm sure the teleporter is here. Well, maybe not. <laughs> So can I not open the door? Oh. One last thing, I seem to remember there being a door, uh, some sort of entrance, underwater in the moat or so. But obviously, I was mistaken. So let's get back up there. into the citadel. Though the city was well fortified against vampires, its human architects hadn't considered a breach by a creature such as myself. Well, good thing for the humans that your breed, brood, your clan was kind of, well, annihilated. I'm so glad those guys don't want to fight me. <laughs> yeah, the human citadel much more e on the easy side. I know there's a way to open that. I also know that there's a teleporter somewhere. Oh well, we will find both in time. That guy did not worship me. Should I return and kill him? For his insolence? Ah, now we are in the citadel proper. This is where I remembered things being there. Well, first I would very much like to get the teleporter. But I don't think I'm gonna find that anytime soon, so let's start with the moat. Since you can swim, which is two upgrades after the first time, actually. No. Oh. Now, is there gonna be a gate on the other side? No, there's not. However, I just thought of something. 
first of all, you die. This gate looks awfully familiar to me in the trade. Oh great, now I get to look for one of freaking portal. Ah, there's one. Um Yeah, anyway, that shape looks awfully familiar. Aha! That's what I thought. I wonder where this will lead me. Graciel, would you kindly get the camera behind you? You know what, I'm gonna explore the inside of this thing first without spoiling where we are. This is the way I'm supposed to go, right? Right. Going deep into the water supply of the citadel. Ah, and swimming monsters. Of course! Get out of the water, Raziel. Seems like that guy down there doesn't do a whole lot. Oh, hey, a climbing wall. Um, let's not go there yet. Let's go this way first. Hmm. A statue, you say? And it seems like this statue wants us to... No! Let's just hope nobody saw that. I thought he was a vampire, you see. Now that could get us into trouble with the other humans, which would be bad. The worst thing about it is that in this world, humans sh seem to share um, their memories. Also, I seem to remember that pushing this block into the water will help me somehow. Now, is there another block I could use? Knowing my luck, probably not. And uh, that hole is quite useless, useless itself. Huh. Maybe there's something else you can do with this block. Like continue pushing it down the stream. I don't quite remember this puzzle actually. So, and what do we do here? Hmm, I think I see something there. Yeah. Pluck the hole. In doing so, we make the water flow that way. What, but what good does that do for us? Well, first of all, we lose control over everything. Because camera. And second, if you return to this room, yay! We get the 
Boczek jest. Awesome. Oh yeah. I need to show off some spells. Let's hope that we can kill every human in the area. Yeah. So, moving on. There's a climbable wall over here, so let's quickly climb up there before the shark vampire can get us. If I'm not mistaken, that should lead us all the way to the back of the citadel. Or at least to an upgrade. Heart piece. Nice. I think I'm just gonna jump off here. Oh no, this is the entrance, isn't it? Well, those humans are afraid of me. Now if only the dudes with buttons were afraid of me as well. Hey there, buddy. Nope, 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 nope. Well, damn. At least you've seen a flamethrower in action. <laughs> that counts for something, right? But yeah, humans are really fragile compared to vampires. Quite the pushovers. They do have the superior weaponry. You know what? You're not even going to get the time to attack me back. I'm um, also, yeah, look up there, that giant ball is the water tank we were in before. It's kinda neat. Also, I seem to be hearing audio glitches, so... Let's kind of save that we got the water glyph. Because it would be nice if I didn't have to do this entire thing again. 